So far in the introduction to community media Tech 1502, I have learned and shaped what community media is. Community media is when people come together and they share the media that they have produced, such as films, documentaries, books, and so on. When you compare this to the mainstream media, the mainstream media is more recognised, the people get more recognition, they get paid, it's more global, whereas community media is more intimate. So far in the lectures, we have learned community media is different. We've learned what is community media. We've learned what is community. We've learned about voices and expressions, community media examples and principles, the decline of community, community identity, DIY media, against the mainstream, and media literacies. Within these lectures, we have learned many pros and cons about community media. One of the pros being citizen journalism. This involves people being able to voice their opinions and their beliefs on a social platform such as Twitter and Facebook. With doing this, they are able to have a debate with people, they're able to have people agree with them, disagree with them, and get more of an understanding of what the community believe and think about certain situations that are out there in this world. Um, the cons are that you don't get as much recognition as you would if it was in a mainstream media. Um, it doesn't. It can go big on um, social media and everyone will know about it, but it won't go further onto the news. So it's that's one of the cons that we've learned about it. Uh, we also do lab work within this module, and we've gone on photo walks where we took photos of our community, the buildings, everything around us within Leicester. We've also gone to our tutor's um, documentary media shop where we watched a film called, no, we watched a short documentary called The Lift. And it's about a man that goes in a lift and he films people coming in and out and asks them questions about their day or just stay silent and see the way that they react. Uh, he's asked questions such as, what did you dream last night? How was your day? Sometimes he doesn't have to say anything and there will be people just opening up to him. And this is a sense of community. He got people to talk to each other that never spoke before. It went, it went on to win a prize, but it didn't, which is very good, but it didn't go any further, like globally, which it should have, because it was a very good, well put together documentary, which was completely different to anything I've ever seen before. Um, overall, community media, for me, which I've learned, is that it, it gives you a sense of belonging. It gives you a sense of, um, having that platform to voice what you want to say when you see things and hear things that is not right in your head and you want to get across how you feel about it. This is something that is, I think is really good and I've got a much better understanding of now.